Hi friends, let's solve one more problem on diode circuits. Here it is asking, both the diodes are identical, find the value of R for which the voltage V is equal to 50 MV. So, clearly, let's uh, redraw the circuit here, 10 milliamperes current is flowing downwards directions here it is diode t2 let's say this voltage across diode dt is vd2 and this is the diode d1 let's say this is the vd1 and this is the resistor and it is already given it is v so if you write clearly the kvl equation in this loop so that is minus v minus vd1 plus vd2 equals to 0 so clearly v is equals to vd2 minus vd1 and this is the most important part for this question so now we know the diode current equation that is i equals to i s multiplied with the exponential term v d over v t so let's write equations for i d 1 i d 1 equals to i s e to the power v d 1 minus divided by v t similarly let's write second equation for diode d 2 e to the power v d 2 over vt now simply let's divide it let's divide these two equations like uh, ig2 divided by id1 which will give us e to the power vd2 over vt divided by e to the power vd1 over vt so clearly this is nothing but e to the power vd2 minus vd1 over vt but the vd2 minus vd1 is nothing but v that is given already it is 50 millivolt and let's take vt is 25 millivolt at room temperature so now id2 over id1 is equals to clearly e to the power 50 divided by 25 that is nothing but e square so this is the second important point in this question. So now let's have a look at the circuit diagram. Clearly ID2 plus ID1, these are the only two branches here exist in this circuit. Clearly equals to 10 milliamperes. If you write KCL equation also yields same result. The both the summation of both currents should be equals to the 10 milliamperes. Now you just sub substitute this value. Let's take ID1 outside, then it is 1 plus ID2 divided by ID1 is equal to 10 milliamperes here. So clearly, but ID1 or ID ID2 divided by ID1 is nothing but e square so id1 is clearly 10 milliamperes divided by 1 plus e square and v is already given in the question that is 50 millivolt is nothing but we can write id1 when multiplied with r because this diode d1 and this resistor r is in series connection so the both will have the same current flowing through them so now r is 50 mv divided by id1 so clearly this is nothing but 50 over 10 multiplied with 1 plus e square so this is nothing but 5 multiplied with 1 plus e square term so let's use a calculator to get answer 1 plus e to the power 2 uh, will give you around 8.389 then multiplied with 5 which will give you 41.9452 ohms uh, approximately this is 42 ohms 
so this is the final answer r is 42 ohms that's it please subscribe my channel thank you